Hey coin collectors, for 1971 penny in condition like these, you can make a dollar tops from his purchase perhaps. However, this 1971 cent brought some collectors thousands of dollars. Hit subscribe button below this video and without much ado, let's find out why this red penny is worth big money. Given coin was graded as MS66 red by PCGS. Yes, being uncirculated is another factor, but the main reason is that it bears double die elements on a verse side. The date, liberty, and the word God are die doubled, but spread is not that wide as in 1955 or 1969 issues. The spread on the date, especially the 9 and the 7, is much more significant than implied by the ill-chosen photo for variety within the cherry picker's guide. A superlative example whose orange-red fields and devices are virtually devoid of carbon. This rare painting was bargained for $10,350 at Heritage Auctions. Moving on to this 1965 Washington quarter in circulated AU58 condition, this 25 cent was erroneously struck on 90% silver planchet intended for 1964 quarter dies. A regular clad quarter weighs 5.67 while weight of this error quarter is 6.14 grams. The present particularly lustrous example is untoned and lightly braided. It was sold for $8,812.50 at heritage auctions. Moving on to this 1949 Lincoln and CAC approved registry coin. Graded in mint state 6 to 7 plus red by PCGS. Although plentiful in lower grades, the 1949 Lincoln Cent is conditionally scarce in MS6 to 7 red, and such coins are rare with plus designation. The striker's sharp and frosty copper orange luster is devoid of carbon spotting. Metal composition is 95% copper, 5% tin, and zinc. Weight is 3.11 grams. It ended up selling for $9,000 in 2021 at Heritage Auctions. Here is 1949 D. Jefferson Nickel in mint state 6 to 7 with full steps, rare at this lofty graded level. Prospective bidders will be competing with registry set enthusiasts for this immaculate full steps representative. A whisper of golden translucence covers lustrous satin silver surfaces. Sold for $5,287.50 at Heritage Auctions. This is 1966 Lincoln Cent in Mint State 67, conditionally rare red specimen. This lustrous peach red superb gem has an intricate strike and is virtually unabraded, but its best feature is the absence of carbon or toning. The fields display prominent dye lines from a mint attempt at removing clash marks, though traces remain within the memorial. Sold for $6,462.50 at heritage auctions. Moving on to this 1950 Jefferson Nickel and PR67 deep cameo condition, each side has beautiful gold patina, while the left of worse field has wisps of champagne rose and violet color. A well-struck superb gem deep cameo proof with essentially pristine surfaces and outstanding eye appeal. Sold for $7,475 at heritage auctions. Here is 2000 p Sacagawea dollar in mint state 67, the popular cheeriest dollar variety. This superb gem example is satin and sharp with pleasing brass gold color. The so-called cheeriest dollar is distinguished from ordinary 2000 p Sacagawea dollars by examining the eagle's tail feathers. The cheeriest variety shows the fine ribs in the tail feathers, while ordinary coins are smooth. Includes the original 2000 Philadelphia Lincoln Cent from same serial box promotion, graded MS67 Red by PCGS. Sold for $4,560 in 2021 at Heritage Auctions. And this is 1973 S quarter in PR70 deep cameo condition, ultimate gem and must have registry coin which displays a perfect strike and exceptional field device contrast. Light golden toning adds warmth to each side. Most earlier issues in the Proof Washington Quarter series 
do not exist at PCGS in PR70, sold for $5,875 at 30 auctions.